What's up, freaks? I want to talk to you about the in-home boxing, kickboxing sessions that we're doing here at Peak. And I want you to realize that when you're doing these punches in the air, whether or not you have gloves on, bare-fisted, you can also hold little light dumbbells. One pound to five pound. Five pounds is literally the max you need on these dumbbells. But I'm telling you this, you do not need any dumbbells at all. I had some fingerless gloves on yesterday when I was doing the follow-along workout. And I was literally just punching the air. And today, I'm going to tell you, as, as crazy as it sounds... I'm in fairly decent shape. I am sore as hell. My shoulders, my lats, even my forearms, just from squeezing the fists and punching the air. Because when you're punching, you're not, you shouldn't just go through the motions. You need to be here. You need to be boom, boom, full speed, bam, bam, full speed on those punches, full technique. So don't just go through the motions when you're doing these classes just because you're punching the air. You need to have full technique, full extension, full intensity when you're throwing these punches because you need to maintain your balance. Learn to maintain your balance while you're missing a punch. So it all needs to be full speed. You need to go all out high intensity. Don't, don't let your mind tell you, I'm just punching the air. I need to slow things down. Now with that said, you want to make sure you're not getting sloppy with it and you're snapping and hyperextending an elbow or letting a shoulder yank out of the socket. That's why this is all controlled. Your whole body's throwing a punch. So when you're throwing a hook, it's not just a fast arm hook. That's why you need to have your whole body into it, the full technique. You need to be, bam, but see my body's throwing it. Shoulder's gonna get sore just from working. You're gonna see just squeezing, and I'm feeling it in my waist and my lats, obliques. That's the way you need to approach these at-home boxing, kickboxing workouts. They're also gonna be filled with additional cardio, abs, core, in those workouts. So these boxing, kickboxing workouts are gonna be considered our cardio sessions. So take the boxing portion seriously. You're gonna get a crazy workout. You'll be dripping freaking sweat, and if you're like me, and, you, and you're going to be freaking sore the next day. As I couldn't believe how sore I was when I woke up today just from doing this one session that I was leading and following along with. If you have gloves, great. Wear the gloves. If you have a heavy bag, even better. Hit the bag instead of the air if you have a heavy bag at home. If not, it does not matter. You will get a crazy workout. You will kill fat. You will continue moving forward towards your goals because that's what this is all about is to keep freaking moving forward. That's it. Just keep moving. Keep moving forward. Take this stuff seriously, work, put in the effort, maximum effort, high intensity at all times, even when you're just punching the air. If you have any questions, comments, just put the comment down below. Let me know. I will talk to you later. You are freaking awesome. No excuses.